flying out and you're heading, headed in that direction especially, it's a good bet to call your carrier. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to do someone else's job for the day? Oftentimes you may think, oh, I could do that, but sometimes it's a lot harder than it looks. Our latest challenge took me to Olney, Maryland. Kong's Black Belt Academy was the place, and just inside I found the owner teachers, the Malakoffs, Mark and Mary Ann. Are you up for the challenge to be a martial arts instructor today? I don't know, I've never done anything like this before. Okay, and this is the dressing room? I was given a uniform to change into. They said, remember the importance of the bow. It's done whenever you issue the special command. Chariot. Chariot. Cunyet is bow. They showed me lots of things I'd have to remember as an instructor, and afraid I might forget some of them, I decided to take some notes that would literally be in the palm of my hand. Treyette, Cognette. I got a quick lesson in how to teach the class. One, two, three. Awesome, give me double high fives. And now, combinations. Hint, him. After a bunch of combinations to remember, I was running out of room for notes. Change sides. Jump. It's called a snap board. I also learned that my students have all been able to break a board like this in half with their bare fists. They said I better be prepared to show them I could do it too by the end of the class. <laughs> right. Those students were obviously bigger and stronger than me. After tying on the red and black belt of teacher, I was ready for my martial arts class to arrive. And what a surprise. My students were half my size, and I wondered if they were even old enough to remember the response to the commands I was about to bark at them. Traje? I didn't say it right, and they knew it. I checked my notes on my hand and tried again. Try yet? Come yet? Then it was on to the combinations. Fighting stance. One, two, three. You don't bow right before you switch legs. Oh, you don't bow? After okay. the students gave me some tips, I tried to see if I could trip them up with a twist in this combination. There was no tripping up these guys. They were good. Mark and Marianne then joined me to show the high energy of the class as it runs on a regular basis. Go! Why do you like this class? Because, because, cause, because they're teaching you how to get a red belt. Oh, you want a red belt like the one I have on? Yeah. Why do you think I have the red belt? Because you're... She had a hard time getting that out because she was too polite to say she wasn't sure what I was even doing there. Oh, do you think I'm a good teacher? Yeah. What oh. would you like to see me do? Break the wall! And so, not wanting to disappoint, I thought, well, at least I'd get some respect for trying. Are you ready? Yeah! Ah! Oh, you did it, Mark! <laughs> and then they sang and showed me they appreciated my efforts in the Western way with a great big group hug. Well, I have to say I did surprise myself when I broke that board. That was wonderful. That was yeah, right. you didn't I, know I was that strong, huh? It was a special treat. Now, Barbara's going to show us what oh, she God. learned oh. today. <laughs> On my suit. Oh, that's I what I can't it do is. without the suit on. <laughs> <laughs> that gives me special powers. <laughs> oh, yeah, apparently it did. Yeah, it's spinning around. Yeah, I think it. there was something in that particular board. What is this? Where'd you get that? Well, that looks like I could do that. Well, I'm, not gonna do that. Yeah. I'm not going to try. <laughs> anyway, that was a lot of fun, and the kids were great. And I thank the Malakoffs for challenging us to do their jobs. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah, Tom. Well, you may need your uh, karate chop to chop the ice this morning yeah. as we've had the ice continuing.